Guys, look at this. 875. 21 carats. 18 grams. I'm going to give you the number here in a minute. How beautiful is that? Check this out, the Equinox, what are you guys guessing? Hit in the comments below, what are you guessing before I start it? 21 carats. Solid 10. I am gonna pull it out and just see that the chain is separate, watch this. And uh, Justin, I saw that you commented on I'm not sure what group it was, but you wanted to know what the chains ring up, right? Here, look. This is a 21 karat chain, guys. I'm gonna spread it out and then I'm gonna... See how it's spread out? I spread it out f complete lengthwise. So all those gum wrappers you guys left I'm guessing that that's the end clasp. And that's 18 sensitivity. We're in park two. Looks like it's a one for the most part. And there it is in a pile. See the pile? So yeah, pretty much you think it's a piece of uh, gum wrapper. So uh, this is Jeremy's Equinox. He's gonna sell this and go ahead and buy himself an Equinox. But what a magnificent find that is. Dade City and uh, I should have probably got that on camera because uh, door knocking 101 if somebody's sitting on their front porch is pretty easy for you to ask uh, for permission because all you got to do is ask you don't even have to knock on the door but uh, this is a 1916 home uh, and the gentleman just Todd and Susan just said that uh, we can hunt their property so we're gonna start in their backyard by their pool where uh, where it's possibly dug up in the past. So I'll be right back, we'll be right back. Tell me it's old. Nope. That's not a good sign. <laughs> Guys, so check out how old this house is. 1960. Spectacular, huh? Gorgeous. Guess we'll find out. Just modern clad 1996.
Hey, can never score too many of those. Oh. Just a bottle cap. What's that? I found my first piece of cool metal. I mean, it's super heavy. First sign of life, guys. What, what? Just because it's the 12 13, I gotta dig it, but it's large. I don't know, it seems too large to. Seems too large to want to put a hole in somebody's yard. I don't know. Heard that? Did you guys hear that? <laughs> and that's the too large. You get a longer a longer signal, right? So that's good to get out of their grass. Or some kind of pen. I'm gonna run back over this thing and make sure this is, this is copper though, ain't it? Yeah, it's copper. I got that on tape. Look at that. 
Look at that. 1944. Silver. Oh, there's silver here. Half dollar. Sounds like, like if I was to say Uber or Super or Massively or Grande or Mui or whatever, Deep, would you guys get what I meant? So I'd say the only thing I don't like about this shovel is it doesn't have like a big enough spade on it maybe. So it's still deeper than that. Like that's all you can bring up for dirt at, at once, right? Like this little bit. Hey, I got a green coin. Oh, man, got all excited. 72? 71. Hey, that's, geez, Louise, guys. It's exciting. I see where I put a little nick in it. I don't want to do that in my first, like, Indian head. But the more I'm digging this, the more I think it might just be a bottle cap. Maybe it's not a bottle cap. Uh, might just be brass. Looks like it's a piece of brass. They screw. It's an older screw. We found the, the walking liberty of our father. Wowza. What up? Say what's up? The 
Memphis, whatever it's the S, the D, or the one of the not visible. That is so cool. I think it's supposed to be above or the below the in God we trust, right? I don't see one at all. That is cool. So, yeah, I think somebody had this in their hand 75 years ago. It's amazing. We buy and sell a lot of antiques, hence we got an old home. And, uh, it's on the other side. I've been taking pictures, right. sending them to my Do family. Guys, good evening. A uh, couple things before we go. This is the end right here. Congratulations to Jeremy today for that 1944 half dollar. Unbelievable, beautiful coin. Um, we have a new sponsor. Uh, Kelly Co. decided that they were going to give us the grand prize for uh, Friday night's game. So it's not going to be uh, the Mind Lab Vanquish. So that's a little bit of a change in plans. Uh, the value will be the same as the Vanquish. They're going to give a pinpointer, I think a couple of gift certificates, uh, maybe a fines bag or something. I don't know what's going to be in the final package. But uh, we did pick up Kelly Coat today for a sponsor. I'm also going to change one of the targets. I'm going to change one of the targets. I'm going to put the gold ring, the 55 diamond ring, in as one of the targets. I haven't decided which one I'm going to take out yet. So I'll let you know that Friday night for the game. So I'll be putting the game together tomorrow. Look for... Uh, the finalized targets tomorrow night. I'll do probably some sort of live feed and uh, I might end up going to Dade City again. I've got some stuff going on up there that I'd, I'd like to uh, record. Thank you guys for watching for real. Love you guys uh, and look for the Kelly Co. Grand Prize in tomorrow or Friday night's Guess That Beep. <laughs>